Yeah, but those were long months. They were strong months. They were King fucking Kong months. Oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! God damn! This guy talented. He's really good. Oh my god. I can't believe we, we picked the right show to come to with this. <laughs> so I want to lead you guys on a little guided meditation that has nothing to do with what I learned at the monastery. <laughs> but it still might be useful. I mean, I am a kind of, I'm, I have some wisdom in here. How could I did all the things that I just done on stage without it? Right? I did things. I made you guys happy. Right? <laughs> okay. This is a little bit of self-confidence meditation. You don't need anybody else's value to value yourself. You deserve love. Do not look for evidence that you deserve it. It is already there just by the nature of your existing here in this improbable orgy that we're going to have after the show. <laughs> so, I'd like you all to close your eyes. Let me get a little posture going. Make your spine liquidy and slick like a tantric sex man in a big jungle. <laughs> that one caught me, caught me off guard too. <laughs> so, visualize a vine up a magnificent tree going all the way up into the canopy so high you can barely see the top branches and it's cool but you know outside of the shade it's sweltering hot and humid but here under the canopy in the ecosystem it's remarkably quiet and peaceful and you're sitting at the base of this 300 foot tree. And all of a sudden, you hear the cry of a bird. <coughs> but it doesn't distract you at all. <laughs> You remain very focused. And then you hear a voice, and it is the forest speaking to you. You are pretty. Fly for a white guy. Oh no. Those trees, cuatro, cinco, cinco. Open your eyes. Six. Thank you very much. Another true fan. <laughs> this is what I live for. I live for people like you and you coming out to the shows and just making me feel seen, making it all worth it. Thank you very much.